Hello YouTube, it's Clay here for episode 2 of Rags to Riches. This episode we're going to be talking about what I've added to the island since we were last year. So for one, I added this uh, kind of setup to explain to people what we're doing in the Rags to Riches movement and how they can uh, donate to us with this hopper that I set up. And we've been getting quite a few donations from people, which is awesome, so... Yeah, it's cool. We'll probably be getting a lot more subscribers on YouTube now. You'll probably notice that our chicken grinder that was right here is now gone because we were building our villager slots and I had to build more over here because there's 13 villagers, I believe. So we moved the chicken grinder stuff over here and Ben's probably going to build that in his next episode. But the coolest thing that I've done since episode one was I added this automatic, well, semi-automatic nether wart farmer. So, basically how I did is I just, you know, set up the pistons holding back the water. And when I uh, pull the lever, it lets the water go. And it all gets pushed into this stream of water in here. And it all gets pushed right here. Some of it gets caught up here sometimes. I'm going to add another row. Let's test it out so you guys can see. See, oh, looks like it went down. And then you just wait, and then you turn it off, and it all falls down. And you've got your nether wart all there for you. That's awesome. Alright, so, yeah. And, uh, oh yeah, I just remembered. Uh, don't forget that we have our parkour challenge tomorrow at 7 uh, mountain time so be there and remember you get three thousand dollars from each of us me and Ben so that's a good deal be here now let's talk about more what we're gonna do this episode this episode I think what we're gonna go do is we're gonna enchant uh, diamond pickaxe try and get a uh, silk touch on it even though the odds are super rare that we get it and we're also going to work on our villager huts back there for our store. And we'll just talk about some more things that are going on with the channel. Today I finally made my channel and I don't know if you've already seen Chris Leader's 8s but it's pretty awesome. He has like two or three videos up now. I'll leave a link in, descrip in the description to his account, to his uh, website. And you can go and subscribe to him. Alright, let's go to the shop. And then we'll go and chant that diamond pickaxe. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay, so... Let's go right over here. Sell some nether warp. Get paid. Alright. Some good money. And while we're here, since we're going to be working on the villager eggs, let's buy some. And they are not cheap. They are 1,500. How much money do we have? Yeah, let's buy a couple. Yeah, that's good. Alright. So, yeah, I set it up to where when people warp to my island, they just see this, and they can send us money, or they can just throw items in and donate. It's pretty awesome. Whoa. Oh, there the hopper goes. Alright, let's get started. So... It's kind of hard to get levels on Skyblocks, so what I've been doing is I've been going to this guy named Etinarum, and he leaves the floor right here open, and so I can go onto his island, which is a lot better than mine. His island's awesome. And he has a mob grinder right over here. Actually, he has three of them. No, four of them. And they're all connected, and it's pretty awesome. You can see here... They have a good spawn amount, and there's always people over here working, and 
Yeah, so that's where I got all my levels. Now let's go to the enchantment table and enchant it. Pretty excited. Let's see what we get. Oh my. Oh, what just happened? What do we get? Yes, we got Silk Touch. Yes. Oh, yay. That's awesome. That's great, guys. Okay, that's awesome. I'm going to have to thank Etinarum. Whew, that was the greatest thing ever. Whew, all right. It was all thanks to Etinarum's XP farm. All right, now people will go to him and... All right, that was my friend Kevin. Well, in-game friend, don't know who he really is. But, man, that, that's exciting, because, uh... Chris Ben wanted a, uh, <laughs> he wanted a Silk Touch pick because he was actually scamming Kevin underscore Minecraft right here. He was going to steal his spawners. And, uh, if I tell Ben that I have a Silk Touch pick, he's probably going to get, try and steal it from me. Uh, let's get started here. Ooh, what is it? Oh, sorry about that, buddy. Did I just... What did I just do? Yeah, I see Fletcher. Oh, that's what I did wrong. Sorry about that. That's like 3,000 gone. Whoops, I spelled that wrong. Okay, so that's awesome. We got another one. Ooh, what is this? Leather worker, nice. Ooh, you know what I need to do? I messed this up. Okay, so I guess I can't I can't put that sign there, so that was not smart. I didn't think that through. Okay, there we go. And let's move these all up. Oof. Man, I'm just stoked that we got that Silk Touch pick. Ben will be excited too. That's awesome. That's super rare. I don't know if you guys saw about the enchantment table. It was like Silk Touch, maybe? Uh, Sure, it's only Silk Touch 1, but, you know, it can pick up spawners and it's all that really matters. So once we get our villagers set up here, we'll be able to have people come and use our little shop here and we'll get paid. Make bank. Ooh, what's that? Is that the farmer? No, cleric. Ironically, that's the sign that I already had right there. Okay. What's this? Armor. Er. Nice. So I've been thinking about some more videos that I'm going to post. And I think I'm going to do a couple with my friend Josh. And we're just going to do a Survive and Thrive series. Uh, our friend set up a server. So now we can all play together. And I, I'll, I'll probably make a whole series about that. I'm also going to make a series about Pixelmon, Twilight Forest with Ben, and, you know, just a ton of Minecraft stuff. Leatherworker, I already have one of those. I have to remove of him. I'm sorry.
Oh, it looks like... What is he talking about? Oh! I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to kill him. No, not, not, not Kevin here. But, let's see. What do we get? Fletcher. I already have one of those. Why? Why do you have to give that to me? Come on. Alright, we might have to go buy some more eggs. Yep. Great. <sighs> Man. I was hoping that, oh no, I need to eat. Let's go get some food. Kevin here is being quite annoying. But yeah, if you guys ever get the chance, join the server, play with us, and it'll be fun. We'll, we might search for some, uh, search for some people to join us. And, you know, that'd be pretty awesome if you worked on a YouTuber's island. Alright, that, that'll probably be good. So much money was wasted on villager eggs. They are way overpriced. Oh, man. Ooh, librarian, I already have one of those. There's got to be a better way to do this. Like, can I put them back in the egg, maybe? Hey, did I hit him? Weaponsmith, I already have one of those. I'll, I'll probably be getting Rocket League or Ark within, uh... A couple weeks so you can also expect uh, some of those videos and I think tomorrow I'll make another video of this because we're gonna open up our vote keys what in the world I'm getting all of the same ones what are you a fisherman do I have one of those nope finally Nice. Only a couple more. Why? I think tomorrow's video I'll finish this up because I'm already going for a pretty long video here. Um, we might set up a spawner tomorrow, but anyways, I'll see you guys later. Like and subscribe.